started, um, I graduated beauty school in 1978, so it was a long time ago, 40 years ago. And I, uh, I'm from Australia, from Sydney, Australia. I, in, in where I came from, there were two beauty schools, big beauty schools in Sydney at the time. One was the, um, the beauty school, the Madame Corner, who was major in extractions. And then there was clay therapy that was bigger in massage. And I, at that time, went to the massage school and where it was uh, clay therapy, the products that they used there was all Ella Bache, the French line. And it was, um, it, they didn't believe in extractions. Wow. So I have, over the years, uh, because of the different things that I've done, I've learned to know that extractions are very, very important in a treatment. And, um, and it's, it's just, but I did come from the training of not learning extractions and not doing extractions. But I, as I said, I know from my experience and, and working with people that the only way to get rid of a problematic skin, to really change a problematic skin, is and to take it to that next level, you have to do extractions. Mm -hmm. And now I am called the queen of extractions <laughs> in where I come from because I do so much of it. I'm very fast with it, but what you don't see on video is that um, because I'm, I'm fighting with a camera that's trying to look through my Maggie lab at the same time I'm actually trying to, it's really annoying. Mm -hmm. um, I, you don't see me do a lot, <clears throat> but I actually end up doing uh, you know, a lot of extractions in, in, in most times in a very short time because I'm really fast at it. But I am aggressive with it and it's how I work to change the skin. Everything I do in my treatments, I do for a purpose. So every step that I do, there is a reason. If you ask me, well, why are you doing that? I would tell you exactly why I'm doing that. I'm not following a protocol. I'm following the narrative joy. This is what works because I know because I've done it for 40 years. So it's um, the, the reason I'm saying this is because there's, you know, when you go to work at a spa or you work somewhere, you are given a, a menu of facials to do. And sometimes it doesn't make sense mm -hmm. to you. And I cannot do what doesn't make sense to me. Everything, you know, as I said, everything I do, it has to make sense to me. And I do it for a reason. And my reason enough is that I'm going to get your skin as good as possible in the shortest time that I can. Um, because number one, you're paying a lot of money to come see me. And number two, I am about getting results. And mm -hmm. that's just the way it is. So it's... Um, with that in mind, to sort of go back to where I started, and a lot of people ask me this question, is how do you know so much about skin? Is that I, when I finished beauty school, I studied for probably 12 years after beauty school. I did bush essences. I was climbing the mountains in Sydney, or, you know, around Sydney, studying bush essences, the Australian bush essences with Ian. And, uh, and I've done reflexology, I've done kinesiology, I'm Reiki 1 and 2, I've done my degree in iridology. Iridology is reading the iris, the eye as a whole. And um, what I can tell you what's interesting for us Estes uh, in iridology is when you look at the, the iris, the coloured part of the eye, is that every, it's like a clock, so that every part of that iris is a different part of the body. Wow. Okay, so the, you know, you've got your head region, which is at 12 from 1 to 11 o'clock. And as you're getting closer to the pupil, that's all the intestines, your large intestine, your small intestine. So what's interesting to us Estes is the skin and circulation. So around the iris, excuse me, the iris, which is the color part of the eye, you have your, your circulation around the iris. And that shows when your circulation is really good, you don't have too much of a buildup of a gray sort of buildup around. Um, it's a smaller, a, a, a smaller barrier around the edge. But the other thing that's really important to us is that you have something that's called lymphatic rosaries. And lymphatic rosaries are like these cotton balls that look like fluffy little balls around people's iris, which shows when there's a lot of them, that means their lymph nodes are really blocked. Hmm. Uh, so that is something that initially helped me a lot to understand skin. So when I get asked the question of, how do you know so much about skin and how can you relate it to the body? It's because I studied different things and a lot of them I don't use anymore. A lot of, you know, I was crystals on all my chakras. I've done all kinds of things, you know. 
Um, but as I said, a lot of it I don't use anymore. But what it did give me was uh, an understanding of, of the body and wow, it really does relate to the skin. Mm -hmm. So in, as I said, in iridology, it can really, you know, that outer area can, can help me a lot. But to do that, I need a loop torch to be able to look at people's eyes. 